how's it going welcome back to my channel if you are new here welcome 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 i'm so happy that you're able to click on that link to watch this video so today i actually wanted to try a new product with you all and it's actually new to me but it's old in the um <laughs> in the curly hair world but i actually want to try this product because i love the collection from this actual brand and it is none other than shea moisture so this is the Shea Moisture Manuka Honey and Mephril Oil Hydrate and Design Max Hold Gel. I've been wanting to try this gel for the longest. And this is what it looks like on the inside. So it has all the claims on here of what it doesn't have. And it's color safe and it's sulfate free. It smells exactly like the rest of the line. I used to use the shampoo and the um i think it's the um i don't know if it's a hair mask but the deep conditioner that is with this collection excellent i don't know why i haven't picked it up again but i think i've been wanting to try like other products so if i like the shampoo and the deep conditioner with this line i have really high hopes that this will work for my hair so i'm really excited to try this out so if y'all like to see how it worked on my hair then please keep on watching how my hair is looking after a few hours of air drying time um how do I feel about it <sighs> max hold gel they were not kidding when it said max hold gel so it holds to its word <laughs> on that description there 
um my hair does feel crunchy and that is also because i was a little heavy-handed when i applied the gel to my hair i thought like the gel and that buttercream was going to work together because of how it applied to my hair but as it dried i did notice like a white residue on my hair shaft so i know for sure like this won't like i won't be having this in my hair not too much longer probably gonna wash it out by this weekend i know for sure that combination of that buttercream and the gel that doesn't go together well but you probably can just use it by itself maybe probably will work with its own leave-in conditioner i'm not sure um i'm not sure <laughs> but yeah so um right now i'm not mad at it but i'm not happy with it <laughs> because like i i see and i feel flakes <laughs> like flying everywhere i'm not too used to seeing my hair out <laughs> as i told y'all before uh i don't usually have my hair out during the winter time but since it's going into the spring season i would like to experience my hair being out a little bit more so that my hair can breathe and you know flourish in its own way <laughs> it's such a hydrating gel but does it define your curls i don't know I mean, it kind of looked like it did. Like, it it defined the curls over here. Like, it defined the curls, but at the same time, you can, you can really see that white cast on my hair. But I don't know if I love it in terms of the combination that I just used. And, um, yeah, I'm, I'm not sure. I'm not sure, but it looks okay. this video was helpful for you all if anybody was thinking about trying this gel out yeah definitely let me know so if you like this video please give it a big thumbs up make sure you comment down below if you were thinking about trying this gel or if you have tried it before what are your thoughts on it and if you'd like to be a part of this family go ahead and subscribe to my channel i would love to have you here and also don't forget to hit that notification bell so that you'll be alerted when i post my next upload so thank you all so much for watching and i will see you all next time bye Thank <laughs> you.